what is up everybody welcome back to the channel um, so as you can tell I have made some serious progress on the shop and I've definitely got quite a few shop updates uh, a few parts updates for the mark 6 um, so without further ado let's just get right to it alrighty so if you watched the previous video and if you haven't make sure you go do that I'll link it up there or somewhere wherever uh, but yeah man I have made some serious progress in here don't mind me i got the fan going damn bro there used to be so much stuff all over back here i cleaned all this up kind of organized this area and i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna get like some of those like fold out like walls that like are just i don't know how to explain that or what they're called um but i know there's a specific name for them maybe i'll throw one up on the screen uh but yeah i'm gonna pick some of those up and then i'm definitely gonna grab like two more of these boards I'm gonna cut this one and then what I'll do is I'll take that one and I'll put it up there and then I'm, I'm gonna get like I said two more of those boards cut one in half put it there put another whole one there and then another one that I cut in half I'm gonna put right there so if that makes sense um, it'll kind of look like there's like actual walls in this place um, and that's just to get a start on things um, that's like simple stuff that I could do. These are just leaned up against the wall right now. Those were actually right there, if you remember. Um, but yeah, I am so hyped, you guys. I am, I don't know, like I, I, like I said in the last video, I will probably repeat myself a few times, but man, I am so hyped to see a car in here um, and it be actually like pretty damn clean. Um, like I said, there's still lots of lots of work to do in this place. Got a little chill spot going up front. That fan will get moved, um, and this stuff will get organized. A lot of that stuff will get hung up and whatnot. Um, and then I want to clean up this area as well. Like, just, I don't know, I might actually get another one of those. Like, I don't even know what that's called, honestly. Might get another one of those boards, cut it up, put it around the, the breaker box there make it look actually like proper um, and actually have like walls in this place. So instead of just seeing, you know, like the the framing of the, the building, I think that would look a lot cleaner. And as you can tell, I've got the pressure washer out. Oh yeah, boys. It's just about time to get these floors actually clean. Oh, I'm so stoked, man. Get rid of all these like spots and whatnot. <clears throat> but, yeah, I just wanted to kind of go around, update things. Uh, I moved the punching bag, obviously. I uh, just got it chilling right there for now. Like I said, I'm still gonna clean up all this stuff uh, and then clean up the rest of this stuff over here for my parents. Um, and like I said, I'll probably put some of those like pop out walls or like they're just like foldable walls and you just like unfold them and they just stand up and it'll, it'll make it look nice in here. Um, and that's the end goal is to make this actually a proper garage or proper shop so I can work on my vehicles and I'll actually enjoy putting content out for you guys because doing it out in the weather, man, is no joke. Uh, living here in Oregon or Washington, uh, the weather is very serious. Like today, it's been on and off raining, um, and, but it's actually really nice out right now. But yeah, you can see some of those clouds got some rain in them. So, yeah. so I am so stoked to finally have a shop to where I can work on my stuff. And eventually I'll clean up all this stuff up here, uh, make it look nice, like I said, um, and make it, make it my own. And I'm so stoked to be doing this. Um, like I said, I've still got a lot of work, um, but let's pull some of the parts out of the car and show you what I got for the Mark VI. It may not look like much to you guys, but this is seriously like huge, huge improvements. Um, and I'm so stoked to grab these couple parts. Um, so, um, as you can tell, it's actually a left front. Um, I don't know why it says 
front right. But yeah, this is a brand new left front fender for the Golf. I'll pull it out here in a second and show you guys. Um, and then right here is a fender bracket that I need. Hood hinges and their reflex silver. I'm stoked. I lucked out. Not sure if I'll need this because I think I still have my headlight brackets, um, but I just grabbed whatever I could find at the local junkyard. And I got this, this fender from this place called Spalding. Uh, that place is legit, man. They have like a bunch of, bunch of stuff that I need for my car. So I definitely plan on going back here soon and grabbing a couple more things that I need. Uh, but let's unwrap this fender um, and make sure it's good. our fresh new fender for the golf i'm so hyped honestly the left front fender uh was the the most messed up so i'm stoked i was able to pick one of these up brand new um i think honestly the the right front fender is salvageable but we'll see i'm not not 100 sure but i'm stoked to have this um and i'll definitely be putting this on painting it soon um so yeah i'm hyped Obviously, I still need a few more parts, but they have most of the stuff I'll need, which is awesome. So they have pretty much like headlights, um, and then what else do I need? I don't need a bunch of other stuff. I'm just trying to think, honestly. I know I need new headlights um, and a couple other things. But I'm stoked to grab these couple parts, man. Um, they were like super cheap, so there was no way I could pass that up. And uh, I'm just, I'm ecstatic that I finally got some things that I will need. Throw this guy in. But yeah, there's a brand new fender for the Golf. And uh, like I said, some hood hinges that I definitely need. And I definitely need that fender bracket for the front right fender. Um, and like I said, I might just end up picking up an, another brand new right front fender. They just didn't have a right front fender at the time. Um, they definitely had a couple other things that I need. So I would definitely be back to Spalding. So shout out Spalding. I'll try and link them down below. Make sure you guys go check them out if you're in the Spokane area, um, and need parts for your car. Obviously now you guys kind of know what happened and why I haven't been driving that car and why I got a daily. Um, and more on that will come at a later later time in a later video uh, but i'm probably gonna just wrap this stuff up put that stuff up um, go over a couple more things and then i might break out the pressure washer get that going but i would like to get most of all this stuff out of here um, and whatnot and then i'll show you guys outside and then inside uh, that other room over there um, like i said eventually i'll be living in this place uh, and like I said, just making it my own. Um, so, I don't know if I already said, but I'm probably gonna, probably gonna use this, clean that up, use that. If you watched the previous video, like I said, make sure you go watch the previous video. There was a tractor or lawn mower, riding mower, sitting right here. I cleaned that, moved that, weed eated all of this. Curb appeal is 10 times better. Obviously, <laughs> obviously, I guess I've still got some cleaning to do, uh, but yeah, I'm seriously so hyped on the on the amount of progress I've made so far. And as for over here, these things still all need to find a place. My mom was cleaning all this stuff stuff up, um, but yeah, eventually I'll be staying in that room, and all of this stuff will get cleaned up. This will all get cleaned out, um, and maybe I can even park another car right here or my car right here and get another car to build opportunities opportunities man <laughs> they are on the way and they are ahead and i'm so stoked you guys 
it honestly looks sick having a car in here like that looks so sick and i know i said that before but damn bro with everything all cleaned out and like this whole half of the shop like actually looking pretty good i think dude i think once i get those other walls put up it's gonna look like it's gonna look really good i'm so hyped get a couple more lights in here have some good lighting like i said clean up that roof eventually oh man but i do seriously need to figure out something or some way to keep the cars clean bro because leaving out of here and going down that gravel road is just tearing the car up man i literally just washed it like yesterday filthy absolutely filthy but i figured i would take today to try and put out a video because tomorrow like i said i had a job interview um well i'm pretty sure i start work tomorrow so i'm stoked with that but like i said you guys make sure you go down hit the subscribe button give me to 1k so i can start making more youtube videos actually get paid for it um and eventually do this as a living you know what i mean like i would love to just put out content after content and just make videos for you guys um and do dope shit but it's not like that man i i gotta work a nine to five i gotta i gotta pay bills and i you know i i'm not i'm not youtube famous man i'm i'm some kid literally just messing around with cars and i just have fun fun doing it so uh, if you guys enjoy that, like I said, go down, hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, give me the 1K. I mean, it does stay pretty cool in here, which is fantastic, uh, but it, I know it will definitely get hot working on the cars and whatnot. So I do need to come up with a solution for that. Um, so yeah, but again, that's all later stuff. Right now, I just wanted to come out and do a couple shop updates, let you guys know where I'm at. Oh man, I've made so much progress. It does. It might not look like it, but I really have made so much progress in this place. Like I said before, you couldn't even pull a car into this place, man. It was insanely dirty. Let's clean up these parts. I almost forgot the most important piece. I found a radiator, boys. This is the only thing I need for the Golf to actually run and drive properly. Um, the radiator that I have has like a small hole in the bottom. I tried JB welding it, didn't work. Um, but I've got a radiator and I'm so stoked. I had bro. the pull and save um, and I lucked out, man. It was like the only Mark V that they had there uh, and the whole front core support was off of it. Um, I wish, I wish the, the front core support uh, was the same for Mark V, Mark VI, but obviously if you want to go, you know, mark 5 core support you'd have to you know do the whole mark 5 front end swap it's obviously not what i'm trying to do but radiator is the exact same and i'm so hyped uh so like i said let's clean up these parts put them somewhere safe um and uh continue on it's not in the best shape either but it holds liquid and that's the main purpose it holds fluids and i'm so hyped all the mounting tabs are good and man that's literally that right there was the only thing i needed for the car to have all its fluids and run properly um so i'm so hyped with that so stoked that i got that and uh yeah so for now that will do until i can order a brand new radiator um, but i want to get that car back on the road man so i think what i'm gonna do um is uh just grab some cinematics real quick of the shop the car sitting in the shop man it looks sick i know i've said it countless times and i've repeated myself multiple times but you guys i am so stoked to have this area for me to work on my cars and uh start a new life for myself man i'm so hyped so let's just hop into that real quick <music> Thank you. 
little corner is just kind of like my chill spot when I come out here. But for right now, those will chill right there. The rest of the stuff will chill right there. Um, that air compressor is going to get put in a good spot. And I'm going to eventually clean up all this stuff uh, and make it nice, man. And I'm so stoked. And the amount of room I have in here is absolutely perfect, bro. Like, I could fit a whole other car right here and still have room in front. Like, I can for sure fit the Golf and this thing in here and another car if I wanted to. Obviously, once I clean up the rest of this stuff um, and organize all that stuff and uh, everything will have a place. Um, uh, it's really coming along, guys. I don't think I'm going to pressure wash today. I think I'm going to save that for tomorrow um, or another video or whatever because uh, I kind of started late in the day. Um, it's still super nice out, but I'd rather just uh, start fresh tomorrow. I would like to properly blow everything out of here again before I start pressure washing. Um, but man, I'm so hyped. It's really coming together. I can't. I really, really can't wait to get a couple more of these walls, put another one up there cut another one in half, put half of it there, and then the other half there, close that up, make that all nice. And like I said, probably do another one there. But yeah, man, that is probably it for today. Some shop updates, some Mark VI updates. And uh, yeah, um, this thing, I think I'm just gonna go go static with it. Probably just grab some, some cheap coils or something. Actually, Raceland. Shout out Raceland. I'll link them down below as well. Make sure you guys go check them out. Definitely uh, definitely going to grab some coils for this thing soon. Do a couple little mods. I stopped at some really cool places today. Uh, Boosted Coffee opened back up. Um, I don't know if you know what Boosted Coffee is. But Devin Nimala and Bobby Wallace, Jamie Wallace, um, they all run that uh, coffee shop. They reopened today. Uh, I went and stopped by there earlier today. And then I went and uh, actually checked out this pretty cool shop called SMT or STM. Yes, yeah, STM Tuning. Um, and super, super, super dope shop, man. Super cool guy. Uh, I wish I would have got some video, but I'll probably go uh, go explore one of these days and uh, do like a do a vlog about just going to some some uh, Volkswagen Audi shops and whatnot. Um, and uh, yeah. And that is gonna wrap up today's video. Seriously, thank you so much if you guys made it to the end. I really appreciate your support. Um, I'm so hyped. I got a lot of work done on the shop and uh, I've still got a lot of work to do. Uh, I think I'm gonna pressure wash here in the next couple days, bust out another video for you guys. But man, I am so hyped. Look at that, it's starting to rain already. So thankfully I'm ending off this video. Um, but yeah, um, definitely, definitely stoked. I got some parts for the Mark VI super happy uh, i've got some got some mods coming for the daily so make sure you guys stay tuned um and that's pretty much it you guys know the deal like comment subscribe stay tuned for more turn on the notifications tune into some great mark six volkswagen audi content and we'll see you all in the next one peace